What's going on guys? Wandering Nomad here. Um, wanted to talk today about the CVSA or the Commercial Vehicle Safety Alliance Operation Safe Driver Week. Uh, it is happening now, um, July 14th through the 20th of 2019. This year's emphasis is on speeding. Um, I have a lot to say about speeding. So, uh, we'll start off, their tagline for this year is, late won't kill you, speeding will. Which I, I think is, is accurate. Uh, according to uh, the CVSA, nearly one third of all accidents were related to speeding. Driving too fast for conditions, uh, which I did a video on that weathering the storm. Check that out if you haven't already. Uh, driving too fast for conditions, speeding, um, that kind of stuff. So I wanted to talk a little bit about speeding. I see a lot, I'm, I mean a ton, of truck drivers out here who think they have to get somewhere in a hurry. Well, first thing I want to tell you is if you have to break the speed limit in order to make a delivery, you're with the wrong company. If you have to break the speed limit in order to make money, you're with the wrong company. The reason I say that is because good companies will, uh, they'll work with you. If you tell them you can't legally make it, they'll reschedule the, the appointment. If, um, you know, it, and, and as far as the, sorry, if, as far as the, um, if you have to speed to make money, I feel that's true. I feel that if you have to get from point A to point B as fast as possible to make money, you are in the wrong business or at least with the wrong company because if you make enough money, say you get paid per mile, if you make enough money per mile, you won't have to drive as fast. If you're on percentage, if you make enough money on the load, you won't have to drive as fast. You'll be able to make your money that way. So these people that are doing 70 mile an hour in a 55 zone, it's one, it's creating unsafe conditions for those of us who actually do the speed limit. And yes, I know I'll catch a lot of flack for this, but I do the speed limit. If the speed limit says 55, I am doing 55. I'm not doing 56, I'm not doing 57. I'm doing 55. Because the word limit actually has meaning. And here's a rant for you. A lot of you guys that I've seen in Facebook groups and YouTube videos and stuff like that talking about foreign drivers, you're saying, well, according to the FMCSA, which this is true, according to the FMCSA, you have to be able to read and understand the English language. Now, what I wonder is, do you guys read and understand the English language? Yes, this is my rant. You can say, yes, I do. I was born here. I'm, I've spoke English. I don't speak any other language, whatever. But do you understand English? Do you understand what the word limit means? My guess is no. So you cannot talk about people not reading and understanding the English language if you don't do it yourself. It, that is my biggest pet peeve out here on the road are people who are in such a hurry, speeding, tailgating, that kind of stuff. That is my biggest pet peeve out here. Because obviously, you're in a hurry to get somewhere. That falls down to trip planning and you working for a company that'll make you more money. So, what I'm really getting at here is you don't need to speed. 
you don't need to do it. it there's no point. That extra three minutes you're going to save isn't going to make or break you if you know how to trip plan. Um, one thing that I can say is I've actually got trip planning down. It took me quite a while to learn how to do. Um, I got trip planning down. So I've learned how to maximize my money, how to maximize my miles to be able to make the most amount of money possible. Now, the other thing that the CVSA is looking for with Operation Safe Driver Week, their emphasis is on speeding. However, they're also going to be looking at and focusing on handheld device use. I have seen people going down the road just holding their cell phone right in their hand. I don't get it. I don't get it. This right here, $40. You can get it at any truck stop. Now, yeah, you can get the more expensive ones. You can get the more, you know, the higher end ones uh, until my dog decided to bite it and chew on it because of my own stupidity of leaving it out. I had one, one of the Blue Parrot 450s. Wonderful headset. Loved it. Again, another thing. Watch out for those headsets that cover both ears. You're not aware of what's going on around you if both ears are covered. You can't be. You can't hear the sirens before you see them. You can't, um, you can't hear your CB radio if somebody's trying to get your attention. It's unnecessary. It's unnecessary. We're out here to be safe. So, Operation Safe Driver Week, the 14th through the 20th, of July 2019 I apologize for the rent but take it or leave it if you see me on the road you'll see me doing the speed limit go ahead and whiz by me but I will assure you I'm not the one getting a ticket I'm not the one putting my CDL at risk you guys are till then make sure you're safe I know I end my videos with be safe Make sure you do it this week. Be safe, guys. Take care.